and vibrant way. Tonight, a rare and wonderful opportunity to distinguish two of our most revered voices, two legends who represent the touchstones of Kazakh culture, two men who embody the spirit of our history and the dreams of our future. Both of men, Abai and Shakarim, were poets, composers, philosophers, and enlighteners of 18th and 19th century, whose written legacy are very much alive and contemporary today. Abai Kunanbayev wrote, a man is launched into the world with songs, and there is singing when he is laid to rest. All the glad and sad events in life have songs to go with them. I think it's universal, and so very much in the Catholic culture. We are a nation of song, a people of music, and I hope tonight you will witness yourself. We are also a people of action. We are old and yet young and ambitious country, willing to prosper and bring prosperity to others. We enjoy strategic partnership relations with the United States. And just in a month's time uh, from today, we will celebrate the 23rd anniversary of our independence. As my president, the Sultan Nazarbayev, said, in the short time frame, we have covered the past of a century long. For me, as a diplomat who, uh, whose work is to bring understanding, to see the soul of my land given the voice by Maestro Carl Jenkins, one of the world's greatest composers, is wondrous. Tonight we share in lives of Abai and Shakarim, the genius of Carl Jenkins, the wondrous talent of our virtuoso violinist Marat Bissingaliev, and the brilliance of the Almaty Symphony Orchestra, which has traveled from afar to perform tonight here. We come to this legendary hall as interested strangers. I hope we live as friends brought together by music. I wish everybody to enjoy music and get inspirational like Carl Jenkins did. I hope you will enjoy today's concert. Thank you. <laughs> 